Hello guys and welcome to what will be the first episode in my draft of glory on the um, FIFA 18 Ultimate Team Nintendo Switch and I've actually had a mare guys, I've recorded the whole of the start of the draft um, I had a load of packs from the World Cup mode that come over to Ultimate Team and I'd done the SBC on the Europe, um, the Europe SBC sorry on the World Cup mode to get 12,000 coins to go into the draft and um, it turns out somehow somewhere down the line it didn't record any of that so I just sat there for 13 odd minutes recording that doing the live commentary and uh, yeah I've got no footage so basically all you're going to see at this stage is me showing the draft that I've, that I've done and uh, yeah I'll basically talk you through what the plan is with the series but yeah this is the team so done pretty good to be fair a few little improvements you could have hoped for but yeah we got team of the year Ronaldo um, 93 centre forward Hullet which is amazing um, to link the chemistry up a bit at that top part of the team um, that is the Champions League Bale team of the uh, season Ericsson great card we got transferred Fabinho to link a nice bit of chemistry there to Tellers as well um, I believe what's that that is, I can't remember what these ones are called, but are they international heroes or something like that? Yeah, so we got Garay, no chemistry, I think only, what is it, five chemistry on him, but he's got a nice card and that shouldn't matter too much. Then Mustafi, just to link all these Prem players together, he's not too bad. And then, uh, yeah, this unbelievable Valencia and unbelievable Kante, um, he's almost got 90s all round, just a great, great card. Um, and then, yeah, team of the season. Um, Courtois in goal, very nice, and then just a few decent subs that we can bring on and change the game. Um, and no, no one to really m make a note of in these reserves part, but yeah, quite a nice, high rated, good team that we can, yeah, we should be able to do, do bits with. But yeah, what my plan is with this series, guys, is uh, to just do this and see how far we can get and see how many coins we can make. Um, before the start of FIFA 19 comes out um, so the, yeah that's that's the plan and then on this account um, yeah it's got as you see it's got no games or anything so I can basically do, I'll do whatever you want any videos you want to see really on this account um, in the those packs I had from the World Cup mode I did actually get this info Moist that was quite good maybe we can do something around him maybe build a Prem team or something and take that into seasons um, and then where yeah, we've got these cards from the footies, I did vote for Rose because I like Prem Team, so he was my pick. But um, yeah, so the normal setup for these videos will be a live commentary on the part where I'm drafting, um, and then I will post com the highlights of the four games or however many games we actually play, depending on how far we get, and then I'll do a live com of the uh, packs the pack opening part and uh, yeah that will be the setup for these videos just like any standard draft glory video you see from the likes of uh, Nepenthe, Fez or AA9 skills but yeah that's it um, yeah sorry I couldn't show you me drafting it I don't know what happened with the recording but um, that's the team and uh, I shall see you in the gameplay part Right guys, back again. This is the post commentary bit of the video now where I'll go over and co look, 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 can't talk at all, post commentate on the highlights. And straight away, oh, terrible, terrible. You, I didn't bother showing any of the highlights of this game, but there's the guys team. Quite a good team, not great as chemistry, but uh, it was a close game, a good game. He was good to be fair, the guy. And uh, he scored a 90th minute winner to beat me in the first round, so I thought I can't have that and uh, yeah so we do we go and open our rewards for well we call it rewards it's not really rewards but yeah for losing the first game we go and open those packs and uh, yes yeah, so we get a silver players pack gold pack and a silver jumbo pack or something yeah there we go and uh, yeah so we'll quickly open these and uh, yeah so I'm going to open these and then I'm this video I'm going to do another draft which you're going to see and uh, yeah I can't start the first episode of this new series losing that in the first round so you've got that to look forward to in a bit but yeah we don't 
obviously those packs we're not going to pull anyone good what we do get is a few Premier League players that I just keep um, everything else we end up selling which we'll see later on um, because this series at the start of the when I'm doing the first draft section of the video I said it's going to be draft of glory but I've decided because of how close we are to the um, start of the new FIFA as I just show you the new team there uh, quite a better team there we get 100 with chemistry on that and uh, yeah I'll just show you all the players and uh, yeah you'll see you'll see who makes the difference in the coming clips but yeah I've decided that I'm just going to use this account and use these videos from now on it's just going to be like me having fun doing all types of different videos so it won't just be purely drafts but yeah we can uh, decide on that down in the comments and stuff if you leave your suggestions of what videos you want to see and uh, I can try and get them out for you I probably will do a draft next video as well but then sort of from that we'll probably start changing up a bit and uh, yeah just showing you going through all the stuff we've sold so we have actually managed to get enough to um, go straight into another draft after this so yeah no matter how well we do in the next one coming up um, it doesn't matter we'll be able to make another video doing a draft at least um, and yeah nothing really crazy to be honest no one sold for sort of over 2000 I don't think just yet all these sort of rubbish number of silvers nice to get a bit from surprised at how much some of them went for but yeah I was just listing them up for like 200 coins lower than their um, lowest bin on the market at the time I was looking and then yeah, it's just a few more listed up going through them and uh, yeah we do eventually get all these sold I do just discard a few as well I think because they took ages to sell and uh, I just can't be asked to store them in the club really sitting there we need to you get all the coins we can but here we go into our first game and uh, yeah, the top picks, as you'll see coming up, top picks from the team. Oh, actually, just quickly before I go rambling off, um, the all I do for the instructions is all the defence stay back on attack. I left the midfield, and then the all the attackers, the left wing striker and right wing, they are all the same, but um, getting behind. So yeah, it's literally defenders stay back while attacking, and attackers getting behind um, and then yeah this is the first guy we come up against decent team not the greatest chemistry but the players he's got in there it's uh it shouldn't affect them because their stats are so high and they've probably all got at least five base chemistry anyway so their card stats are what it says but we start off really quick here not even well two minutes but it wasn't quite two minutes on the actual clock and uh yeah Ronaldinho is putting that in and to be honest, the whole team, the only disappointments were uh, Aubameyang as he does score there. But that might be his only goal of this uh, of this draft. Actually, we'll have to see as it, as it goes on. But I think it's probably yeah, he didn't get many at all, and I expected a lot more from that inform. Um, but yeah, the picks for me, Ronaldinho, obviously icon, just a great great player. I loved watching him in real life, and it was. The first time I've used him on FIFA as well on the Ultimate Team. Really, really good. Um, and yeah, enjoyed that a lot. Also, Hazard losing that left forward. Um, I can't remember what those cards are called again. Uh, International Heroes or something. His card, that left forward up front, is so, so good. He's sort of like a messy player where he's so small on the ball and uh, he can just. He just dribbles and his agility and all that and his shot just all of it he's great great player um, then into the midfield Fernandinho that 85 upgraded card just solid uh, sort of box to box and he just gets tackles in breaks up play and passes it off to the more creative players um, Mata he was all right to be fair scored quite a few goals and was good in that centre, um, centre attacking mid role and what I sort of was doing was leaving him on for the first half normally um, and then I would bring in that team of the season Pjanic who was unbelievable as well you'll see some goals from him uh, just one here actually as I'm speaking about him but yeah and then Inform Pogba great same similar thing to uh, Fernandinho just great all round 
bit more, gives a bit more in attack, and obviously he's got the height on his side as well. But yeah, really top player as well. The defence, Van Arnholt and Lind uh, Lindelof, you would expect nothing from them, expect them to get torn up, and they were so solid. I have actually used them both quite a lot in normal ultimate team in my actual squads, and uh, yeah, they're very solid players. They got not the most amazing stats but they've both got enough pace and enough defending to um, to yeah just do the business and they just players that play well it's weird sometimes you just have players that don't look great and they just play well um, and then who was the other centre backs can't for the life of me think uh, oh yeah Van Dyke was very good as well I haven't used him before and that international hero Valencia is amazing and then the De Gea as well so just a really nice all-round team as we win the first game 9-0 I believe and uh, yeah just showing you some of the stats uh, yeah just very nice way to start after we lost in the first round of that first draft to get a nice big chunk of coins and uh, yeah progress onto that second game and uh, yeah it's very very interesting because EA have been absolute lads and just put um, as you've seen just down there quickly um, just showing you sorry on the screen just doing a few of those manager tasks to uh, get some uh, other stuff and add some stuff into the club um, and then yeah you just see all that business loan player pack nothing crazy I'll just let that play out but um, yeah EA have released all team of the seasons and uh, I can't remember, I think it was Winter, one to watches, and um, the Path to Glory, the ones for leading up to the World Cup, the players that might be like fringe players for their um, nations. So, uh, yeah, hoping to get some decent um, pulls out of that, depending on how far we get. But I was just, yeah, completing a few more of these tasks, and all that the only one we got left is getting fit, but we can't do that until we've played a normal game. Because it won't let you apply a fitness card until a player's actually lost fitness, which, oh, pardon me, very unprofessional of me there. Just add some coke, um, burping all over the show. But um, yeah, you can't, can't. There's obviously, there's no such thing as fitness in draft, so can't do that until we play a game. So that will happen in the next few episodes. But then here we go into our second game now. Um, and quite yeah, quite a few people are using this kit against us actually. This. Um, is that for Pride or something, the LGBT um, kit? I think so. I'm not sure, to be honest. You'll have to forgive me. Put down in the comments if you know what that kit is. But this guy's got a nice, almost full chemistry team. Some great, great players in there. And I was getting a bit worried looking at that. But we uh, we start the game off here. 13th minute, Pogba running forward, plays it into Hazard. And, uh, yeah, that's just showing you sort of... That goal it sort of epitomises... The strengths of Hazard there, not so much the dribbling side, but he's just there, ready to accept the ball right in the centre of the box, just ready, not offside, and then just see yeah, a lovely finish, and then same again. He's playing it around the back a little bit, and we uh, steal the ball, and Hazard finishing was just out of this world really for me. And this not many that he missed at all, but um, yeah, 54 minute now. Ronaldinho unlucky there doing some good dribbling on the edge of the box curls that and it's oh, so close to going in off the bar but Hazard's there for the rebound to get his hat trick so he's up to about seven goals I think I think he got four in that first episode maybe not uh, first game sorry maybe not but he's definitely on uh, about five and then I don't know what Valencia is doing that far up the pitch but he's uh, in the box and the uh, I see the goalie come out and I don't really know what was going through my mind, but just instinct, I thought, try a little dink, and it somehow goes in, I love that goal, and, um, yeah, we get a free kick here, and I put Pjanic on this, this is just, yeah, this is his stats, I think it's almost 99 across the board, and I, to be honest, from that position, I think, as long as you don't blast the power, you're just going in, yeah, as long as you, just get the power close enough to what it should be it's going in because the stats are just unbelievable 
and he actually really impressed me as well. He was one of my favourite players to use, but he gets a goal back. Fair play to him, kept going. 70th minute, Messi. It's hard to keep 95 striker Messi down for a whole game. He does manage to score there. And uh, yeah, into the 73rd minute now, almost straight again. We've brought on uh, Douglas Costa at this point, who is a great card, and you'll see he's big for us in this uh, draft as a sub. Scored an important goal along the line but yeah 6-1 now and then 81st minute coming along go for a shot just went for a shot saved it and then yeah a rebound falls to Hazard and that's enough for the guy and uh, yeah to be fair to him it, I would have started thinking about it for age quick at that point although it was, it was in the 80th like in the 80s when it comes to minutes so you would have thought he would have been able to just hang about for that little bit but obviously not you can see there I've brought Ronaldo there, move Hazard into the cam roll. And uh, yeah, was piling on the pressure. 678 coins, nice to add to the bank. You see quickly on the stats, dominated him for shots and stuff. And then I don't know what happened here, software closed down and stuff. Luckily it didn't count as a disconnect, we'd already uh, sort of exited the game far enough that we'd uh, it had registered with one and stuff. But then, um, semi-finals or third game now we come up against this guy who uh, he had a random blue kit and then the um, buy-in away and this team was probably I think the best team we come up against and it's unbelievable really quite a few well, maybe those few known rare suicide um, Carrico and that goalie not so good and then the centre-back can't remember we had uh, Aspila quite a normal and um, Coutinho, but basically the whole game was back and forth, back and forth. No one, none of us could score all the way through um, normal time and extra time. Goalies making saves left, right, and centre, and just yeah, just none of us could put it in, hit the post, and all different bits. You know how it is when you just think maybe the game's against us here. We can't seem to score, but we go through to penalties, and uh, yeah, we do well. I think we score all four here. He uh, misses, or he scores that one. That's the first one he scores, so it's 3 1 at this stage. But yeah, we score this with Ronaldinho, and uh, yeah, that takes us through. We score all four of our first four penalties, and um, he misses one, and we save one, I think. And yeah, that was a really tight game, and it was very nice to get that win on penalties. Penalties is one of them on FIFA, as much as it is in real life. It's it's just 50-50 really you start getting that momentum and that can help you on that I think that's what happened really in that one I, uh, I got the first pin and he misses one and then from there you just you just got the adrenaline going and it's all just flowing and it's yeah just happy days 586 coins see there not many chances I had four, four on target he had seven shots five on target but he had quite a few long shots and uh, yeah, just a tight game. Fair play to the guy. Could have been, could have gone either way quite easily. But then now into the last game, the final. So we've managed to go from the first draft we've done losing the first round. We've got to the final here. So I'm thinking, happy days. I'll go into this game, no pressure at all. Not won't put any pressure on myself. And uh, just yeah, see what we can do. We're bound to get some decent rewards now, no matter what happens. A cup against this guy, and yeah, again, like I said, he had that LGBT kit, I think, and um, didn't use it, but he had he obviously yeah, had it. And he's got probably actually, I'll take it back from what I said about that last team, he's got the best team of views, not the best chemistry, oh, sorry, not the best team of view, best team we've come up against. Some ridiculous players in there, and uh, I was very worried looking at this, so I'm not sure if he was in the final as well, but he must have been far and it starts off five minutes in and his team of the season Aguero bangs one from outside the box with his weak foot against the hair and I'm thinking oh no oh no we've got to, we've already got to come back from this now but not too long later in the game 20th minute I've brought Pjanic on straight away because I thought we needed him instead of Matter in there and this, that is a lovely finesse that was one bit of an unusual one not a, like a sort of normal looking finesse he sort of just leant back a little bit and just caressed it 
that looked more lifelike than normal when it just slid out. That was beautiful, that goal. And then Ronaldinho running down the wing here. Slots it through to Hazard. And this is, yeah, this is a Hazard goal. Just dribbling. He can't handle it and uh, finesse that pass. So we've gone from 1-0 down after 5 minutes to 30 minutes and we're 2-1 up. So I was buzzing at this point in the draft final. And, uh, yeah, just well happy. And then this was it was a close game. There was a lot of... Well, not a lot of chances, but chances for either player. And uh, this one did annoy me. That was probably a mistake that did show Lindelof's um, lower rating there. He could have easily headed that away. I don't know how he hasn't, even with his low rating. But Aguero is there, and he's volleyed that in. And, uh, yeah, he's showing his rating, to be fair. That's a great card that I be, wouldn't mind using in a draft later on. But, um, yeah, and then it got tight, and in extra time... He's uh, playing it around the defence, and as I said, Douglas Costa popped up with a massive goal there. Steals the ball back and a lovely outside of the foot finish. And uh, yeah, he was great coming on. He's a sort of another player similar to Hazard, where he's so small, so fast, low sense of gravity, and his dribbling is insane. And he's got the shots and that to finish, go with it. But you see there, yeah, 10, 10 and 6 shots on target to his um, 9 and 4, or 8 and 4. So we do actually manage to win the draft, guys. I let this just play out and uh, yeah, go into the packs and the live bit. Hello, guys. James back again with the live section of this draft video. Here to open the packs after you just would have seen me um, winning the draft. I was surprised that I managed to win that. I had a couple of tight games, especially those last two, but um, yeah, really decent to come through it. Uh, and yeah, get the win. Uh, you saw the packs just then, uh, so we got two in the store. I'll just quickly get rid of this stuff that I've sold. Uh, just some, just rubbish stuff really that we just got from opening those um, packs earlier on. And uh, yeah, so we can get rid of that stuff. We're up to 23k now. Um, so we are going to be able to do another draft if that's what I choose to do next, which I probably will without the uh, without whatever we get in these packs. But yeah, let's get straight into these. And uh, yeah, so we've got a gold pack and a rare players pack. Now hopefully, hopefully the luck's big because I believe there's all the team of the seasons and just some unbelievable cards. Who do we get in this gold pack? Left back. Oh, Damien, not too bad. We've got him on um, the loan one, is it? Uh, all this we'll just save this for now we'll actually we'll just save this stuff um, yeah and then all of this can go up to the trade pile to try and sell and then yeah so that wasn't too great but at least we've got a Premier League player because um, basically this yeah what I've decided I've spoke about a little bit I would have um, yeah so this series is going to be just sort of anything it wants to be whatever i decide to do with it really because we've only got a couple or not even a couple of months now till fifa 19 comes out but yeah so i'll try i'm trying to sort of build in on a uh, first owner um premier league team and uh yeah we'll open this second pack and hopefully we can pull something big who do we get? Oh my, we've got Bashwai. Look at that, guys. That is fucking unbelievable. Sorry, excuse the French, but look at that for a pack. That is absolutely mad. Look at that. I don't know how much these go for, but let's have a quick look. Oh, well, 160 is the lowest bin, and we got a bit of 56 there. That is very nice indeed. What about this screen, our guy? That is a decent. They're all, all unbelievable cards. Um, what are we looking at here? It's 25 bid, 95, 90. So his lowest bin's 90. We've, we've done very, very well here. And this Martial, I've actually got his untradeable footies card. So in theory, we don't need this one. I don't think. And that's another. Well looking at 40k at the very least I reckon we can get for that so that is unbelievable I think we'll send all of this up no other Premier League players than, uh, than 
more shell and like I said we've got him already so we can send that and to be fair you don't get a better start than that to um, for winning the draft getting rewards like that that is set us right up now we can pretty much go and do whatever we want and uh, yeah definitely going to another draft <laughs> but um, yeah thanks for watching this video guys uh, next one will probably be another draft and yeah I'll just need you to um, get active in the comments um, and just let me know if you like this if you want me to do some draft challenges maybe where I'll pick certain teams um, and then yeah or well, if you want me to I can do a lot of ruin a random sort of video like the Hilton Fest does where I'll just create a squad and I'll go into a live game and comment like do a live commentary on that or uh, all different stuff really but yeah some unbelievable pulls there all these high rated cards I don't know how much they go for now but then these four we've probably got the best part of well I'd say that's probably at least 100k for Bakshwai another at least sort of 60 there should we say and another 40 there we've got at least 200k there just in them three players so that is very very nice indeed so uh, yeah, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one guys. See you later. Cheers.